Yo, it is Vox. We're gonna be continuing. Totally double featuring that up today. Hell yeah. Uh, actually, that was the wrong load. Game loaded. We, uh, in fact, want to load Game that. Loaded. There we go. It's pretty quick loading. So be it. All right. Somebody was wondering about this time, how it was saying that I've been playing for such a long time. Essentially, what happens is. Uh, they up the time to the maximum amount of time, which happens to be about 4.2 million seconds. Um, and uh, they do that to stop you from basically destroying the scoreboard by getting the same score over and over and over again just by reloading the level. Kind of clever trick. But, uh, yeah, if your score changes, then I think you can uh, submit the new score. So this level, actually, we don't want to dig there yet. We're going to give, uh, make a gold room here. And that's pretty important. But we also need another gold room, and I think what I'm going to do is just have an imp dig there and start doing things of our own free will. We need a hatchery of some sort. And uh, we really need a library so we can start researching. I think I'm going to put the library through here. And then we'll put a training room in that room. I think that looks good to me. Go ahead and grab a couple of imps. Have them do that. The imps are pretty slow, unfortunately. So what we're going to do is we're going to possess one. And we're going to do it for them. As you can see, we're much faster as a, a keeper at doing imp stuff. We need to be a little quick. I haven't shown the map yet. And the reason for that is that uh, don't have much time. And uh, take all this. I'm just using the map to navigate, if you're wondering, by the way. I'm not really uh, focusing on what I'm seeing. Uh, take these little parts here as well. Alright, there we go. Now we need another gold room. Just here. And the purpose of this gold room is that we're going to start digging this gold immediately. A little flavor text thing, which I've been failing to read so often, sorry about that. Powerful creatures inhabit a cave south of here. That's a party of, there's a party of heroes between you and them. But if you reach them and convert them to your side before they join the other keepers, you will be unstoppable. Unless you do something stupid. <laughs> so, that's the gist of it. We're going to use uh, this gold room to grab the gold from here and get the creatures behind it. A little dangerous, there's some other things behind there we don't want, but... Well, we need to take a couple of risks. We zoom out a couple of times. I think I... Did I load the map just then? Either way, we have two enemy keepers. Uh, as compared to the normal one. One's over here, one's over there. They're on opposite sides, so you can have them fight each other, but don't let them get that powerful, just kill them. <laughs> That's my uh, plan. Get this guy to start researching, we'll need to make this big enough. The vampire is crazy good at researching, so that will go up pretty damn quickly. There's only one creature that has um, higher skill than him, I think. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, maybe I'm thinking of the wrong thing, but either way, he, he's damn good, so definitely worthwhile putting him in there. There we go, that's a spell already. Yeah, we're going to have low gold reserves for a little while here. Not much we can do about that. There are gems on the map. Here, uh, here, and somewhere around there. And as you can see, this guy has the best one, that guy has the second best, and we have the worst gem block by far. Uh, there's not much we can do about that. Alright, have you finished digging out that gold? Because it sounds like you have. Yeah, okay. We're not ready yet so much, so... I don't know, we'll dig some gold here. And that'll get us some more gold. Because we need some more gold. I'm gonna get one imp. Well, we'll dig away at that later anyway. But, uh, but at the moment, yeah, I think we'll just uh, have the imps prioritized down here. Or wherever they want to do. We need enough gold to finish that training room, and then we can open the portal. Uh, yes, we need that bridge, actually. Bridge is going to be useful here. This is a good place to put guard posts. Actually, it's a very good place. I'm not going to do it, personally. Because uh, I think I can take all of these creatures without too much of a problem. Yeah, there are a lot of heroes. You'll see what I mean in a few moments. Alright. There are shortcuts for going to these rooms. I personally just right-click on the thing if I need to. I think we have enough... Yimps should be in danger, but, oh, relatively safe. They can take this. And in a few moments, they'll dig through. 
Well, a gold seam is dug next to a door. The door will crumble. We're gonna need you now. There we go. Attack. There's a fairy. You're gonna have to watch because he'll teleport away when he feels like he's done. But he's gonna be good for killing all these guys. There's quite a lot of them. Kill that monk. Yeah, there he goes. See what I mean? He'll just run off. You can always possess him. Switch to the uh, drain spell is the best one to use. In my opinion. And zap them. Ah, uh, good old drain spell. Heals you while killing the enemy. Uh, there's not many better spells than that, really, if you think about it. It does a decent amount of damage, but uh, this guy has quite a decent amount of strength as well, so it's worth using his melee attack. As you can see, it's doing a good number on these guys. <laughs> so I'm going to use that quite a bit. Does a lot more than drain as well. But switch to drain whenever you're lower on health. You can use fly as well. So now I can fly. Kind of like uh, how the fly flies. Oh god, it's... Inverted controls are weird. Die. They, don't, they can't hope to do enough damage to me to make this a problem. So we'll just keep doing this. Yep. Uh, good old vampires. See, I would let just unpossess this guy, but I have a feeling he's just going to teleport out of here. So I want to do most of this myself to make sure that we don't get loads of uh, heroes wandering around my dungeon. Oh wow, this melee is insanely powerful. It's not like he has super high strength, the dragon has higher strength. This guy has like, what, 300? I don't know. Lower than the bile, even lower than the dragon. It's not like it's bad or anything, as you can tell. Oh crap. Dungeon heart being attacked. That'll happen. Uh, if you let one through. That's fine. Fairies don't have much health. Right. There's a couple more left. <laughs> Kill the last few. Alright, here's a good place to dig gold. And uh, so I'm going to set my imps to start digging around here. I'm going to dig in this vague direction. I think that's a good idea. Alright, once you finally won a battle, you can go back to researching. Drop him. There we go. Might as well finish this hatchery as well, I guess. A lot of people have been saying that uh, small rooms work better than large rooms. That is, lots of small versus a few numbers at large. I don't know, maybe that's true. But uh, I haven't really noticed that. Anyway, we don't really need any more rooms because it only takes that much gold room and uh, lair to attract the dragons. And dragons what we need. Get uh, three more rooms, I guess. And we'll drop one to do that. How's this mining going? We'll set up a bit more mining just to make sure that we don't run out of gold. Running out of gold is a major problem on this level if you uh, do it. You are pretty screwed if you do. I'm going to possess this guy because I have to, uh, I need for speed. We need to get through here. So we go here. I think this is right. Maybe it's one to the right. Well, we'll tell. Yep, one to the right. If uh, imps are kind of slow, so what you can do is you can slap him and use the. Uh, I slapped him a little late there. Use the speed spell on him, slap him, possess him. Now he is uber fast imp. Problem with uh, imps is they only heal when they are not doing anything. So if you need your imps to heal, you can stop them from doing jobs. You could, for instance, put them in a locked room, and they will go ahead and uh, heal themselves up. It's kind of funny, they take out a little cigar and take a puff. I find it very... It's almost cute, really. Ah, uh, imps. I don't believe I just called them cute. Whatever, maybe I did. That was stupid of me. A moment of weakness. Hey, we have imps. Not imps. Imps. <laughs> vampires. You get three vampires from doing that. As you can tell, kind of worthwhile. So, we'll pick up this gold. And set some more to be dug since they seem to be done digging. And there are more heroes in that last chamber that we have not dug into yet. We're gonna, we're gonna need to. We are going to need to go in there some time. So you're gonna have to watch for that standing coffin. What the hell kind of lair is that? I know you're vampires, but come on. 
Will they? That's nice. Yeah, it sounds like he's angry at me. So, why is this not claimed yet? Should have been claimed a while ago. Whatever. We should get a uh, graveyard soon. That's pretty cool. You can get a lot of vampires on this map. It's always nice to have a vampire at the start of this map because they can research so quick. So quick. Don't know what's with the uh, tone going on there. They're growing their, like, they have, they start with their portals claimed, so, uh, we're a little behind. I wonder how many creatures they have. It is payday. Wow, one of them's already maxed his number of creatures. Probably with really terrible creatures. Oh well. What we can do about that is dig a little out here, I think. That looks good to me. Drop a few rooms to do that. Off you go. What we're gonna put here is the guard room. The reason for that is that they will meet at this point, the two keepers, so by putting a guard room here, you pretty much make yourself impenetrable to them. We can just drop creatures here at need. Alright. I say we kill the one on the left first. Yeah, it looks good to me. Why do we have one of you? I don't want one of you. I want dragon. Give me dragon! Ugh. Give me terrible creatures. No, don't use magic attacks, it's a steel door. You use melee attacks. See? That's how it's done. I think I'm just gonna take this guy over towards the dungeon hut and be a pain. Because that's what I do. Might raise a ruckus by uh, using the... whatchamacallit, drain spell. Wind! Why wind? Just because I can. And now we attack that dungeon hut, because it's right over here. And they have for some reason left it unguarded. Boop -a -doo. Eventually they'll realize I'm here. Oh, here they go. Oh no, you've noticed me. And I can heal. I could pretty much uh, infinitely attack this because, uh, well, A, I'm immune to poison gas attacks, so that's basically null. And drain on the heart gives you life back, so... There's nothing they could do about this. That's a lot of creatures. I say we kill a couple. We could scavenge for them, actually. I might set up a scavenging room at some point. That would be funny. I cannot see what I'm doing. It's lagging a bit as well. <laughs> there goes the rims. Always fun to kill their rims. I think it's the best idea. Do, 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 do. I'm running low on health. I know. I'll use health gaining spells. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, just like the dragon, the vampire can just never run out of health by doing this. That is a lot of creatures that do not like me. <laughs> oh, let's kill these bugs. Squish. I think I squished that one, but I can't really see anything. Oh no, there it is. There we go, squish. Squish. Oh, look, a fly. Where'd that fly go? There we go, squish. Hey look, mortal enemy. Squish. <laughs> Mortals. Ah, uh, mortal vampire will kill you. Come back here and die. I'm attacking your heart. Heart can't recover. It never recovers damage, so uh, you can just keep doing this. I probably will. I find it funny. Uh, the power of transporting a level 10 vampire. Level 10 dragons work as well for the same trick, uh, because the dragon uh, has the heal spell and has so much health and defense. I haven't really mentioned the defense spell, uh, the defense stat very much. Dragons and bile demons obviously have pretty good of it. It does make health more important by having the defense stat. Oh, do. Come on. Move, bile demon, get out the way. Oh, I should have should have made that joke with the imps last uh, episode where I was saying, move, imp. Move, fools. Move, mortals. <laughs> oh, I am going to rip those spikes off your chains and uh, shove them down whichever orifice I feel like. I only have two of them. I wonder how many orifices you have. I don't know why I wonder that. They have bile demons. Let's see, they've got two eyes. And they've got nostrils, presumably. They've got a mouth, I think, although it kind of looks like it's almost sewn together. I'm not entirely sure what's going on with that. Wait, we lost a creature? When did we lose a creature, and how, and why do we have tons of these? Um, we got lost in the map there. 
Oh, that red vision does a number on my uh, ability to see. Oh, wow. Uh. Oh, you teleported out. Where are we under attack? Why are you running up there? How stupid can you be? Get back. I think they're trying to pick up the corpses. Um, yeah, don't do that. That's one reason not to get the graveyard there. Oh, uh, whatever. We'll kill these guys some more. Try and destroy their dungeon heart now. No! Stop! Ugh. I can't hit them with this. Even if I did, I'd just be killing them for them. Oh, there goes those imps. I don't know why they're attacking like that. They're really stupid with them. There. Eh. I think I just zapped one of their imps. Ah. Uh, so many creatures. So little time. I'm out of my way. I have a dungeon hard to kill. There we go. You can tell when you're hitting it because it'll sound like you're slapping it. And I kind of like that metaphor. Slapping the keeper's heart. <laughs> uh, you could say that the vampires are a real bitch for this. That that would be a terrible joke. Why would you make that joke, viewers? Why? Oh, there goes their heart. You get shrink every time I slap it. Slap, 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 slap. Oh, I'm not hitting it now. There's a bile demon in the way. There we go. The, uh, the other keeper isn't much more dangerous than that. It's always a good way to deal with them. So, I lost uh, two imps, that's not too bad. And yeah, we'll throw these guys into the training room. I think I'll take that dragon to destroy the next... The next guy, that is. I think the dragon can do it, a single dragon, why not? This guy's still trying to uh, taunt me, which is pretty funny. We'll just burn this. Zit, that is a terrible name. Yeah, they give them names, which is pretty cool, but why is it... I wonder what my level 10 vampire is called. I'm going to go back on that and uh, look at it a little later. Uh, vampire vampire -y. Doors take ages to kill with flame breath. Yeah, dragon's better at magic doors. It'll eventually break. I might even... I'm not, I'm not going to skip. You know what? Yeah, okay, never mind. I didn't need to skip at all, even. Maybe I will edit it out, just to go back on my word, but you'll never know, because I edited my uh, word out. Ha! You don't even know how many times I've done that, do you? The answer is zero. I am always right. I am always the truth. That's not true, but whatever. That's ironically not true at that. Ugh, this guy is still taunting me. I wonder if I can burn his ceiling. I am. Oh yes, like a fly. That was pathetic. Ah, something actually worthy of damaging. Oh, they do a lot of damage, and for some reason I can't seem to hit them. I need to use the spell, the speed spell on them, so they're actually kicking my ass. Oh, come on. I can't even hit them. Come on. Damn it. Oh, this is bad. Okay, that's not working out as planned. Just throwing level 1 bile demons like that at me. That was mean. Uh, why are you fighting that fly? Stop being silly. Oh, because he's fighting you. You, have some fun with him. Yeah. You can just stay there to stop them from claiming. Kill him! That's not like it. Ah, uh, dear. Get rid of all these rubbish creatures we don't need. Have you sleep? That was a poor performance on my part. Sorry about that. What are you gonna do? Oh, I has, has it? The prison! Oh, we took over their portal. Wonder if we're gonna get any cool rooms from that. We've lost another imp. How lame. There we go, more imps. And we'll pick up this stuff. Ugh, running dry commentary. Never a good sign. Oh? You dare to oppose me? Why are you fighting imps? Go away. Yeah. That's a lost cause on your part, but I'll throw in these just to make sure that you realize that. Level 5s don't have the drain spell yet, so they can just melee them, um, which is particularly effective, really. They do have teleport. Level 4 teleport is just silly, what the hell? Alright, let's try this trick again. You have low health, but whatever. Zit. God, I wouldn't be I wouldn't be too unhappy if you died, just because your name is Zit. Ugh. Come on, I need to hit something. Yeah, for some reason, homing on this is really hectic. Hey, I'm hitting something because my experience has gone up. 
Hey, level two. Now level two, you get heal. Best thing about these guys. Let's find more things to kill. Do 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 do. Do do do. Heh. <laughs> Just storming towards the dungeon. Oh, he teleported away. That's too bad. You need more torches in here. Good thing I can provide my own light. And full health. You can do this all the way to level 10, in fact, just fighting with a dragon. I think I've mentioned that so many times now. I don't know, though, because of how many recordings I cut. Imps! Yes! Ah, uh, killing their imps gives me so much joy. So much joy! <laughs> there are more imps to kill. Oh, look, a troll. I have a feeling I'm being attacked from behind, but I don't really know. Right, charge him, so that you actually get to hit him. Who's behind me? You. There we go. I'm hitting you now. Now you die. Even if I face the wrong way. Good old homing attacks. Who's attacking me now? I think that's a... That is an imp. Why it's not dead yet, I don't know. That's more like it. And we just heal. Did not gain much experience from that level 1. Need some higher levels to kill. I wonder if I can find that training room. Orcs are good. Orcs can be good for, for killing. They normally go to the training room. Wait, did they? He just picked him up. Lame. Ah, here we go. Now he's dropping some more at me. Yay, more dying. <laughs> oh, th triple kill there. I wonder if you get experience from killing the heart. I do wonder that, actually. We'll probably be able to find out at this level. Since you gain experience so easily. Hey, finally killed that. Guy. Oh, we got another vampire, cool. More vampire. Yeah, you get a lot of vampires in this level. And uh, that's pretty much enough to kill anything. Vampires are kind of awesome like that. Get out of my way. Die. Burn. Smolder. Smolder, what the hell? <laughs> oh, come on, you'll do enough dying soon enough. Yeah, if you're not hitting them, just move towards them. That's my best advice. Maybe they'll start hitting them soon. They are. Oh, I've lost another imp. How, how spectacular. Oh, now he's used uh, Cult of Arms. I don't think he's uh, happy with me killing all these creatures anymore. Yeah, just, just a feeling I have. I want to kill these imps, but they're so annoyingly hard to hit. Because killing imps is the best thing in this game. It really is, because it costs them so much money. Killing a creature doesn't necessarily cost them money, that's the thing. Unless it's like above level 1, then it does, but killing imps always costs them money. Ah, uh, dear. Wow, I'm not even taking much damage from this, I can just keep this up. Almost level 3 as well. Ah, uh, there we go, full health again. Yep, so much for all that damage you did. Come on, I want to hit that warlock finally. There we go. Oh, not. I was hitting him. Some of these creatures are just hard to hit. Dragons, for some reason. There we go. Burn, dragon. Is this not irony? Die from your irony. Oh, city imps. That's fine, I have enough money to get more imps. Oh, wow, I don't have much money. Oh, whatever. More burning. I'm just going to treat this like an FPS for now. Ah, ah, ah. Maybe I should restrict myself from the later levels to not being able to do this, because this is so much fun. But uh, at the same time, uh, kind of overpowered considering how many creatures I've killed. Just stormed through their dungeon and killed most of their army. Hey, I'm actually hitting something. Burn it. Yay. Why can I not hit that warlock ever? Is that a beetle attacking me? Whatever, I think it's dead now. It's hard to see with, with all this fire in the way. <laughs> Made this hard now. Is this really all they've got? Oh, look, a troll. I think. Where are you? Oh, it's an orc. An orc. Look at him, purple skin, white hair. Yeah. That's that. We have a grenade now. This is great for killing imps. Finding imps hard to kill, just uh, throw grenades out in the room. Heh, <laughs> I killed that warlock finally as well. If they hit you, they're probably hitting the things hitting you. And uh, that's normally enough to kill them. 
Ah, imp disposal grenades, so good. Just heal again. I'm being hit from behind, aren't I? Maybe in front? Nope, definitely behind. Let's try and just stab me in the back. Good. Another freaking orc. How many orcs do you get? Wow, I was for some reason hitting the heart. But what are you doing? Stop raving your generals at me. Ah, oh, Rage. Rage at not being able to burn you. There we go. No, damn it. Ah, There we go. I don't know how people manage to do that humming thing all the time. There we go. Most of the time it just fails for me. But then when you get it, it's hilarious. This is why the dragons like fire and bursts compared to the uh, keeper doing it because uh, they're not entirely sure if they're hitting or not. A lot of the time they don't hit, so as straight creatures they're actually pretty useless unfortunately, because their main attack is broken. Wow, I didn't notice that my health was slightly that low, but uh, it doesn't really seem to matter. I will hit this imp, somehow. Oh, come on. There we go, at least I'm hitting this Biolemon. Die! Die, enemy I wasn't even aiming for. You're my enemy. You might as well die. You're also fat. Oh, the smell of budding fat must be horrible. Although, maybe a dragon likes that. Probably bad taste, though, a bile demon. Probably really foul taste. Screw it. Grenades. Just gonna walk into them. Is that a spider? Yes. It's dead now. No more spider. Is there another... I think I have a fly and it's attacking the dungeon heart. Okay, hold on, hold on. Operation keep fly alive while it hits heart. Go. Oh, this could be very funny. Do they have any creatures left? If not, this is just perfect. I have no imps. Probably deal with that. No, don't kill my fly. I hope those imps don't die. I kinda need some gold. Actually, I know what I'll do. Your creatures are falling in oh, that fly died. I wasn't paying attention. I'm sorry, viewers. I just can't kill them with a fly, it's too difficult. Probably kill them with another creature. All these terrible creatures in my dungeon. Get rid of them. Oh my god, look at how many bile demons we have. Look how they're all level ones. Your creatures are attacking the enemy. More Dragons, more failure. Oh, at least we have this level 10 vampire. I suppose I'll just throw you onto the guard post. Yeah, why not? Possess you. And uh, charge them. <laughs> I don't know why I healed. I just did. Whew, yeah, you're damn right that dragon's winning the battle. All for himself. Oh, good, you're alive. Dragging back that fly that died. Uh, that would have been funny. But no, since you killed my fly, I bring in a level 10 vampire. And he killed you. There we go. Fight the heart. Okay, fine, don't. What's with vampires, anyway? You just have to use the thing on them. The, uh... What is that spell called? Call to arms, that's the one. Apparently we're under attack. Uh, full health here. Do you want to, like, I don't know. Protect your heart. I think somebody is. Yeah. Yeah. That was lame. That was embarrassing, Keeper. Why why are you embarrassing yourself? Just just walk away now. Walk away back to hell where you came from. I'm sure you'll find it nice. I mean you're clearly not capable of defeating the mortal world, so uh, I'm here to destroy you. Minor attack again. By something really f uh, a beetle, a beetle versus a keeper, possessing a dragon. Oh, you're so small; it's hard to burn you. There we go. It's all dependent on how close you are, as far as I can tell, and how large the creature is. So higher levels are easy to hit, which is a good thing, really. You can uh, train against a level ten with a level one dragon and probably beat them. Um, as a keeper, which is kind of cool, provided they don't have too many range spells. Lightning will probably kill a dragon. Yep, that was that for that guy. Sorry for the nature of this episode, which is just kind of, hey, I'm gonna kill you now. I'm not having a, a fair fight with these guys. I think I already outlined that I'm not gonna have fair fights. The thing about um, this map really is that if they meet in the middle 
and fight each other. One will win, one will be more powerful, and one will destroy you. I've also had them team up against me before, which was disturbing, more than anything. Anyway, we are missing some specials, so I'm going to go and show you where the specials are. There are still a couple of uh, heroes in this area, so we want to be a little cautious. Got my imps to start digging out this gold. Alright, here are the last uh, heroes around here. Oh, whatever, she'll probably get killed by a vampire. Ah, uh, here they are. Haha, <laughs> strafing. Oh, look, a monk. Let's kill it. Killing the monk. Oh, what do, what do we say? We uh, take this one from uh, our seat as a keeper. Watch these guys die horribly. I think that's a good idea. We've been doing a lot of first person in this game so far. Now we deserve to just sit back and watch vampires kill things. I threw away most of my creatures, as you can see, so... Don't have a huge amount of gold in this level, and I haven't really mined much of it. When you get to the gems, though, then, you know, gem it up. <laughs> uh, pitiful attempts to attack me. What are you doing? Fight them. We also have something near our heart, don't we, probably by now. Oh no, sounds like that fairy died. Oh no, there we go. You, do you want to fight him? Or her? Let's see who's better, level 1 warlock or level 1 fairy. Level 1 warlock, that's pitiful. Oh good god, fairies suck. <laughs> oh, evil gods, fairies suck. You have low health. Stop having low health. Low health is for sissies. Not for dragons. Yeah, you go over there just so that the vampire can kill you because it'll be funny. Are you even using your health spell? No, why not? I do not understand. Let's go over here and kill this guy. Oh look, we conquered the realm. Hurrah! Slow imps are slow. Possessed imps are fast. Whee! Right, so we'll eventually break into this cavern if you just go down to that corner. And over here there is an increased level. Don't really need one, but whatever. Then, over in this correct direction, we have another area. And as you can see, there's one special just there, and that's kind of opposite on the map, so that makes sense. And then up here, we have... Oh, this is a long tunnel. Long tunnel. <laughs> long tunnel like your... Yeah, I'm not finishing that joke. Hey, look! Another special. What's this? Transfer creature. What do we need? Transfer creature. So we're just going to save here. That is the end of this level. Yeah, it was pretty easy. So, next level. Dragon time. We set fire to this place. It's still burning <laughs> with a fierce, unnatural intensity, so we can't get anywhere near it. But we're sure you'll love it, once it's cooled down a bit. <laughs> <laughs> wow, uh, we set fire to this place. Oh, you're gonna love him. He's like Mr. Popo, except if Mr. Popo had nothing good about him. This guy is the evilest, evil side of Mr. Popo. This is... Oh, I love him. Oh god, if you don't get that joke, then I pity you for not knowing what comedy is. Wow, what the hell? One point off. Hey, we've almost got that off the scoreboard. Won't that be a glorious day? Oh, look. Buffy Oak, a small location where people simply sit around and enjoy each other's company. And they talk, laugh, and sing without ever arguing, drawing daggers, and dying in a gurgling rush of blood. <laughs> a truly bizarre place. Oh yeah, I do that all the time. Well, except apart from the dying part. I normally let other people to do the dying part. Dying is what other people do, for I am not mortal. Keepers are awesome like that. So, next time, folks, we go and destroy this place with a couple more immortals. Pretty vampires and dragons. Dragons, unfortunately, not immortal, but oh well. They're pretty good, so they don't need to be. We've gotten most of the map done now, as you can see. And since we're over 50%, the sky is turning red, and... Oh, I can't wait until we get to that fortress and burn that down as well. That'll be a glorious day, folks. Glorious.